Let's continue from where we left off in the previous lesson. Select all the side edges and extrude them and move accordingly. Do the same thing on the other side. Go into your edge loop options and select multiple edge loops and insert 5 edge loops on the both sides. Now go into your perspective and go to deform nonlinear bend. In the bend properties, Set 180 in curvature. Rotate the bend in 90 degrees in X and Y axes. Switch to your top view and scale the bend until your mesh is completely closed. Delete the history and select all the end vertices and merge them. If your mesh is not smooth, go into your mesh settings and click harden edges and then click soften edges. Go into your front view and unhide your image plane. Turn on X-ray mode and insert the edge loops where the blue lines are. Repeat the procedure for rest of the lines. Now select all those faces and extrude a little bit in Z axis. Extrude it again to give it an edge loop. Now select the edge loop of the both ends and extrude them and click merge edges to center. Insert edge loops to hold its shape. Now select all the edges of the circles and extrude them a little bit in Z axis. Extrude them again in the Z axis a little bit again. Thanks for watching.